Alright, what is going on everybody, ladies and gentlemen? Simply Pops here. And you have your iPhone 6, your 5S, or even a 6 Plus. But the 6S is out right now. And you don't even want to upgrade. I'm going to show you guys how to magically turn your phone into a 6S. Get the 6S features right there on the fly. So first things first, you do need to be jailbroken. I'll throw a link in the description. Or I'll probably throw it somewhere on the screen right here. And yeah, you do need to be jailbroken. You need an app called Cydia. There you go right there. So you guys can see, I got Force Touch. You got Force Touch there. You can't Force Touch Cydia. You know, all of that running on the iPhone 6 Plus. All right, so the tweak is called Reveal Menu. It is free. Download it, get the 6S Force Touch right there on older devices, such as the 6, 6 Plus, 5S, and get the Force Touch technology. That's it. Force Touch anything. You know what, why not? Let me show you guys some of my settings because you do have some settings for the Force Touch or the 3D feature, 3D Touch. So you guys can copy and paste that sensitivity if things isn't, isn't working out for you. But yeah, I just feel like that's the sweet spot. Okay, so yeah, peak and pop. Peak and pop is in the building. So, peak, right? And then you can pop it right there. Alright, let's move on. <laughs> I thought of a new word. So alrighty guys, moving right along to the next tweak. You guys do know the 6S and the SE have a feature called Live Photos. Well, it will be so much cooler to have it on all older devices. There you go, a tweak called Enable Live Photos will fix that. So now I have Live Photos on my 6 Plus. So just to show you guys an example, I could just move my hands around. And then when you tap on this, the preview, you can actually preview it like that. Right there on the fly. So that's pretty cool. Live photos is definitely a cool thing. You really don't even have that much. You just have the enable, respring, and you have like a double tap gesture. Gesture. Free on Cydia. Why not give it a try? My battery's about to die. Let me see if I can get through all this shit quick. And all right, guys, last but certainly not least, we have live wallpapers. So you guys can see the background is moving. It's slightly different. You know, it's actually just like a video playing on your springboard or lock screen. I consider it as live wallpapers. And normally on the 6S, you got a 3D touch, but nah, that's not the case here. And yeah, it looks really, really nice. So if you guys want that, all you got to do is download a, a city app called V Wallpapers 2. Make sure you guys download the iOS 9 version. Don't download the iOS 8 because, well, it could possibly mess up your jailbreak. All right, so just go into manage current theme, and if you want it for the lock screen, you just click lock screen video, go into the lock screen video, settings, and yeah. And the beauty thing too about this, you can download different kinds of, you know, beautiful wallpapers. Now keep in mind guys, this is gonna impact battery life because this is constantly moving in the background, I believe. You can download this one if you want. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and you guys have the 6S features. It's just basically moving without you actually 3D touching. I'm guessing whoever had the 6S, they could probably 3D touch it. I'm not sure. But um, yeah, so that's how you get live wallpapers. If you guys did enjoy the video, I appreciate it with a thumbs up. Like, comment, subscribe. Share the video with your friends. Much appreciated. And let me know down in the comments down below if you have any questions about your jailbreak. I'll feel free to answer them in the comments. And I'll catch you guys on my next video. Deuces.